Well, we are here at the Thunder Bay Art Gallery to showcase their summer exhibition. It is called The Perspective from Here, 150 Artists from the North, and it is in conjunction with Canada's 150th birthday as well. I'm here with one of the artists, Elliot, Elliot Dockstader Wynn. Elliot, you are a local artist from Thunder Bay. Uh, yeah, I've been here for quite a while. I'm originally from Southern Ontario, but I relocated here a number of years ago. Okay, now you're wearing something very interesting. Would you like to explain that? Uh, this is actually part of one of the costumes. Um, part of my contribution to the to the uh, show it was a gallery installation. But to open the, the uh, whole exhibition, we, my theater company um, called Shaman Zen performed that particular production entitled Shaman Zen um, to open it. And uh, after I'm now installing the finished costuming and uh, some of the the layout of the of the actual performance. Okay, now you are part of this summer exhibition that is going on all summer and it's showcasing many, many artists from the North. Tell me a little bit about your part of the exhibition. Well, as from my background, I, I took some of the work that I do as in, t, in a 2D form, drawings and paintings, and I took those particular characters, those figural characters that are based in uh, First Nations Aboriginal Indian culture of Canada to kind of perform some of the um, kind of a uh, an honor, honorary storytelling of some of the true history, the pre prehistory of the northern part of Turtle Island, which we know as Canada. So that's where my particular contribution came in um, to reflect some of that. Now, what are some of the things that people can see that you've done? Um, like when they come into the art gallery to see the exhibition, what kind of what kind of things have you brought? Uh, well, the, the, the central uh, it, it's central in one of the, in the main gallery, and they'll be able to see the costuming uh, hung on different little platforms, uh, mannequin shapes, and then on the ground is a, a small um, assortment, a, an arrangement of cedar cedar boughs, and cedar is traditionally a medicine for First Nations people, for Indian people, and so that was part of our contribution. Medicine is a, a healing tool, but also these um, visages of these characters that I made were. They are representative spirits, so the spirit of that uh, of the Indian culture is kind of what I'm bringing forward to this this exhibition. Now, have you walked around and seen some of the other artists that are that are in the in the exhibition? Yeah, I have actually uh, because it's reflective of uh, it's this exhibition is regionally specific and and uh, the the jurying and the invitations were um, on like distributed. Uh, to uh, more northwestern Ontario reflection. Um, I actually know a lot of the artists who are in here, and or I'm aware of, uh, of the the work. And there's some, and it's a nice mix of um, kind of what's considered more classical uh, First Nations work. The original group, or the Indian group of seven, including Norval Morris, so Daphne Ojik, are in here. But then there's a lot of contemporary people, and um, and then there's reflections of different kind of medias, uh, everything from from installation sculpture like my stuff to photography painting uh, and both Aboriginal uh, Indian work and non Aboriginal work as well yeah. so what does it mean to you to be part of this exhibition uh, to be part of it I'm hoping that with the reflection of, of the installation and even the performance work is to show kind of that there's a there's another next level to where um, in particular uh, First Nations work can go and being that integration of sound and and the synesthesia of sound smell sight um, the tactile sensation like there was even music involved um, is kind of showing that there, there's still an evolution overall of, of Indigenous work and um, so that's that's hopefully my contribution plus a reflection because uh, you know I'm uh, nas nationally pride first nationally pride uh, of, of the accomplishments of Indigenous people in Canada and uh, I hope to be kind of in that that genre. Well Elliot thank you so much for talking with us and for and for displaying you all of your work here at the Art Gallery. Cool, Jimmy Wetch, and I just like to say thank you for honoring me with uh, being able to speak about this today. Miigwech. Great. So everyone, it's at the Thunder Bay Art Gallery. It is called The Perspective From Here. It's 150 artists from the north. If you want more information, you can head to the Art Gallery's website. Keep watching. There's more coming up on Shaw TV.